bottom, but you don't want it too steep where they're bottoming out. So the, the more you can level it out, the better. All right, first trip on the excavator, all the way down to the end. That's where I'm gonna start. Cut a, cut a trail in way up, up by the road first. I love this, this station, Jack FM. Cedar's got to go first. It's been a little while since I've done clearing like this. Yeah, everything's against me. It's downhill. That cedar's downhill. At the moment, I gotta make some room for myself so I can turn my machine around in here. Check back in after I get it cleaned up. Hill here without 
rolling myself backwards. All right, so if you watch my blade, I, I'm climbing up. It's really steep, even though it doesn't look like it. So if you watch my blade as I'm pulling myself up, you're going to see me starting to tip backwards. Um, the excavator wants to tip backwards. You'll see the blade go up, and we'll see if I can mitigate that or not. Thank you. 
big enough and wide enough, you know, where you could easily get a pickup truck through here. So here's a look for reference about where this crossing is. It's about halfway up our private road and it's on the left hand side here uh, where we're building this new ditch crossing. All right, I got my ramp started, but I don't want to push all that dirt into the creek because I want to know where I got to make my, my bottom entrance. So I'll lift all this dirt out of here. close there you can see it's starting to take shape I mean if you push all that dirt in there it's just gonna wash away but I like to at least you know get all the way to the bottom so I know like if you're driving a truck across it you know how that crossing is gonna sit Keep rolling. Cutting that lip off so you got your ditch like this. So I'm shaving that lip off and now I'm hitting all, all rock in here. Uh, but it's it's not a shelf so I mean I could bust it up with the uh, excavator so that'll work out just fine. But I'm piling these separate from my clean dirt here. steep where they're bottoming out so the, the more you can level it out the better
on his front side. And I'm shaving this down some more we're starting to get closer and then I'll show you my plan to connect it to the road up there because here's my utilities you see them right next to the machine so let's do a little more grading on this
was just seen three, at least three deer right through, the, they went right through this cut. I just made it this morning. So anyways, up here by the road, I'm gonna put a pipe in here. Don't need much, it's not much water, but like a 12 inch. And I'll fill this, cause there's a little dip right here. So I'll fill that in and then it levels it back out over here. So here's the after look. 